Hey guys, Sam from Amphers Makes. So it is Friday, which means I need to reveal the next part of Poppy the Pixie. Hi to everyone who keeps returning and hi to any newbies. It is so great to have you and I am ever closer to my next milestone. Thank you so much for coming and checking me out and thank you to my returners for coming back time after time. I really, really, really do appreciate it. Um, just before we begin, I would like to apologise that I have been a bit on the missing list this week um, in regards to lives and things. Um, I have been having a bit of a pretty tough time of it at the moment. Um, I'm not going to go into details as it's personal for me and my family. Um, and also on top of that, I have been unwell for a little while now and I have finally gotten to the bottom of it and I now have medication and hopefully over the next few weeks and months that medication will help me feel much, much better. Um, I will try and get back to the lives as quickly as I can, um, but nobody wants to see me on panel a little bit emotional, quiet, withdrawn, um... Yeah, it's just not the best vibe to have when everyone else is having fun. So again, apologies for that. I will be back as soon as I can. Um, and um, yeah, daily content still, still doing the videos. That's absolutely fine. I just don't know if I can be up on panel. Um, yeah, a bit of a battle going on, but I'll be okay. No need to worry, no need for concern. Um, I'll get there. It will just take me a little minute. Um, and obviously family is my top priority and YouTube has to be secondary to that. And I hope you understand. Anyway, back to the scheduled video for today. So if you're new here on a Friday, I reveal the next part of the Amigurumi that I am making alongside the beautiful Christina over at Bella and Ginetto. We have a collaboration going where we are both making the same pattern from the same book, but we are putting our own twist on it and we are revealing week by week our progress on these amigurumis. And this time we are doing Poppy the Pixie. So let me grab my bag my beautiful billy bag and get the book for you to remind you what poppy the pixie looks like in the book here she is guys so it is this book here unicorns dragons and more fantasy amigurumi 2 this is the book that we are working from this time on this second collaboration. And this beautiful little creature here is the wonderful and beautiful Poppy the Pixie. Now, we are very, very, very pleased to announce that she is final and complete this week. Now I know last time when we did Koji, we did a big live reveal. Unfortunately, due to circumstances outside of our control, this isn't happening this time. Um, it will be a reveal on this video here and Christina will reveal on her video as well. I will of course save Christina's video into the same playlist so you can catch both and she will do the same over on her channel. Um, we already have plans for the third collaboration so watch this space. I am not saying any more about that until things are 100% finalised and we know when we can do it. But there are plans for a third collaboration. Apologies that we cannot do a live um, and do the reveal. Um, but there is a lot going on and um, we still wanted to show you the end result anyway. So again, apologies and I hope you understand. So, when we left off last week, I had everything done, barring the arms and the legs. So, yep, yeah, you've guessed it. This week, it was time to put the arms and legs onto my beautiful Poppy the Pixie. Another quick reminder while I straighten her out off camera. Um... I struggle with putting my own spin on things and getting out of my comfort zone. So I have taken baby steps with this project to try and help that. And what I have done is I have changed the colours to colours of my own choice and not the exact colours of the book. Because normally I would just imitate what was shown in the book and in the pictures. 
um, but I chose my own colours and I went with it and I am absolutely delighted with how she has turned out and if you are ready I will show her to you now she's got arms and she's got her legs there she is look guys all finished all completed all entire I have done every bit that there is to make her finished so let me get the picture in the book up for you again and you will be able to see what I mean by changing the colours depicted in the book and I went completely different even down to her hair colour. So there we go, there is my beautiful Poppy the Pixie. So Rita, guess what? She is ready to come and live with you over in Sweden and she is really excited to come and meet you and live in your beautiful home and be your mascot maybe. There will be a little bit of a delay Rita until I can get her to you. There are a few more things that I want to put in the package with her so that you get a little bit of happy mail as well. So it may be a little while but she is ready and waiting to come and join you and your family over there in Sweden. How exciting that something I have made is going to travel all that way. So there you go. I'll just give you a quick back view. Isn't she absolutely gorgeous? Really didn't take long, although I did stay up quite late last night so that I could get her finished in time and ready to film, ready for this video to land when um, it was scheduled to. But she was worth the late night because she is absolutely gorgeous. So I will just give you a couple more close-ups. There's her pretty little face and her fringe. She's wearing her little hat. She's got her gorgeous redhead curls. She's got her beautiful wings. Her really pretty dress and petticoat. And of course, the new addition of her arms and legs. So yeah, I'm super pleased with how she turned out. I hope you have enjoyed following along with us. I hope you have enjoyed seeing her progress as the weeks have gone on. And actually, this was a short one compared to Koji. So, who knows what is coming next? We have a vague idea, but nothing specific. We just have a different twist on it. So, thank you for coming over and checking out my gorgeous little pixie girly. I really do appreciate your time. I would also just like to quickly say a massive thank you to Christina over at Bella and Ginetto for again working alongside me in this collaboration. It is such a pleasure to work alongside such a wonderful lady. She is becoming a super, super close friend of mine. Um, I love her super amounts. We talk regularly and I am just so honoured and thankful that you have taken the time to work with me on a second project and we are already in talks on a third. So thank you so much, Christina, for doing this with me. Thank you so much for taking time out of your busy schedule. Um, I have loved every single minute of this collaboration, both the first and the second, and I really cannot wait until we do the third. There may just be a smidgy break before the third one comes though, but please do keep watching both of our channels. And if you are not part of Christina's channel, you really, really should be. You are definitely missing out. I will of course put her link down in my description box. Please do click on it, head over there, check her out. And if she is your cup of tea, then please do become a member of her family um, and join us for all the fun along the way. So yes, thank you, Christina. I have absolutely loved working with you for a second time. I know your poppy is just as equally gorgeous as this one, if not even more so. 
because the way Christina did hers was involving her daughter. So she is even more extra special. And Rita, I really do hope you enjoy Poppy when she eventually makes it to you. And I hope you are pleased with the end result. Thank you so, so much for giving her a home. And thank you so, so much for thinking my work is good enough to want it for yourself. It means the absolute world. So... I will, of course, put Rita's link down in my description box as well because she also has a YouTube channel. So don't forget to check her out as well, guys. I'd really appreciate it. So that is it. Manfella versus Poppy the Pixie is done. Thank you so, so much for coming back week after week. Thank you so, so much for spending your precious time with both me and Christina. We really appreciate it with all the wonderful content out there. It is always really appreciated when you come and see ours. So yes, for one last time, myself and Poppy are going to say goodbye and we will see you very, very soon. Well, I will see you very, very soon. Christina will see you very, very soon. But this is probably the last time you're going to see sweet Poppy because she is, of course, being rehomed in a different country. So there we go. So say bye-bye, Poppy. Say bye. Okay. Thank you, guys. I really, really appreciate it. Remember, stay safe, be kind, look after one another, get some good quality time in with your loved ones and get some good quality time, crafty time in. And I will see you in the next one or around the YouTube streets. I love you all loads. Please do not be worried about me. I am fine. And I will see you very, very soon. Love you all.